Yeah, I, I, I have something to say. There, there was a, a general request that we do this shirtless, uh, but I can't because I'm horribly scarred. Mm. And I've got a cold. And Neil has no excuse. That's right. No, I'm, um, I've been working out, um, but I want to wait until I'm at my peak, until I let it be known what's going on. And you said you were 65, right? I'm 65 years old. Yeah. But I'm built like a 45 year old. Yeah. That's amazing. No, no, you, you look great. Me. You look great. So it's three 65 year olds heading out to the second floor. You got that That's part it. right. Yeah. Here to we show go. you what goes on. Come in, won't you? Join yeah. us on the elevator. Uh, you just missed Donald Faison. He he ducked around the corner. Yeah. He's a, he's not 65. Though. No, he's, it's a, a, he's, he's not, he's not in the club. Yeah. He's just barely 40. I think. Is he? Everyone on television is older than you think they are. Yeah, no, that's true. Yeah. Uh, Jim Belushi is going on seventy. Is he? Yeah, like, he looks it too. Like he looks every minute. Yeah, of yeah. Is that, is that according to Jim? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Is that what Paul? Yeah. That was go ask Jim. Call it that tomorrow. That's the best to call him. Though. Maybe it is go ask Jim. What does Jim think? Uh, you know, Jim thinks he's a kid. Yeah. He you does. know the way he plays around. Oh, he thinks he's a child. He won't let that girl come to work. You what know girl? that that girl. What's your name? Arena? Arena? Court? Something. Anyway, no, it's something where things where gyms Arena. take place, where Jim Connor take place. Yeah, I won't let her come. One day a week is all she comes to work. Do you have any idea what you're talking about? No, I thought it was something about a game or something. <laughs> <laughs> James Conn, maybe you think? Oh, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> we were on Jim Belushi, but that's a... Oh, well, all right. Well, Jim where are we anyway? Way. What is this? We're on the second floor. For some reason, I was immediately drawn to a non... Uh... Well, this is a room where there isn't anything. These are the backs of sets. You see quite a lot of that around here. Yeah. And you never know who's on the other side. It yeah. might be... I think it's uh, our locker room find this out. week. Locker room? Be locker room, yeah. It's What's just, in there? It's claiming to be an on-call room. It's an yeah. on-call It says locker here, so room. somebody's lying. We'll see. Right. We haven't used this in a while. No, it's on-call room. I'm going to turn the lights on. Oh, there's a, there's a man. Oh, there's a man sleeping. sleeping. Take a quick picture yes. of him. And then we crew member. Right. You're fired, sir. Yes. He was he was up all night. Well, we'll let him drag yeah. out. And that was and working on work. things, and now we've just totally interrupted his. Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, oh, Chris. These guys work far uh, harder right, than we do. Discover a few new tattoos. Somebody's going to bring it. Oh. <laughs> right. You can blame the guy for trying to get a little sleep during oh, lunch. Oh dear. Oh dear. I thought he was just sleeping. Right. Who else are going to wake there up? There are probably more people. I'm afraid to go in. <laughs> now, too. We, we just going to wake people up. Yeah. Well, Elizabeth's awake. Though. Elizabeth is awake. Yeah. Yes. Eat, eating your lunch? Yes. We're doing a, a tour for the blog, is it? Yes. I thought it was the blind. <laughs> That's uh, why I was talking so much. Oh, yeah. A oh, you might be right. A video tour for the blind? Yeah. Hmm. Well, it isn't. But that's Elizabeth anyway. Yeah. A lot of scenes take She's place She's in the camera here. department, yeah. She is the camera department. She's the heart and soul of the camera department. That's what everyone she really, And she certainly has the nicest smile. Is there anything worth seeing on this floor? On this, oh, yeah. There's, oh, you uh, know the ICU. Let's go into the ice cream unit. Is that what it's about? I think called? that's what that's called, isn't it? I don't know what it's called. That's right. Just so the one so you can take it over, I think. Okay. Each of these rooms is like somebody's headquarters, which took me a long time to figure out. Like each department has a room somewhere. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. I opened the door one time and it was like the sounds room. I didn't know sound had a room. Yeah. You, you still, you just look. No kidding. Yeah. It is one of the grip stations. Right God, here. it's wonderful the things you find out. Yeah. Uh, the grips hang out there. Out the there. grips hang out in there. If you need to grip something, you could, you could go in there and grip a ladder. And the first aid guys parks his car there. Yes. So those are sets waiting to be used. The first aid guy's name is uh, is Steve, and he has a mohawk, and he's not even an Indian. The old ICU, huh? Yeah. Now, I've been told I have a chair with my name on it. You've been told that? I have been told. I have yet to see it, though. I don't have a chair with my name on it. I saw well, it on eBay, I think. No, you mentioned it. no kidding. Yeah. Well, what turns out that even if you do have a chair, what you really have is this strip of fabric with your name on it. All the chairs are interchangeable. But but you could take that fabric off, and then it wouldn't be your chair anymore. That's what I'm it saying. It would be somebody else's name. This is Special K over here. Our script supervisor. Yeah. Yeah. She makes and she's nice. 
She, she's very nice and patient. And Special case. See? Whoa, Special wow. Case. Hey. Nice. And she even decorated it with macaroni and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> we should get your cake, though. <laughs> And what do we have here, Neil? Well, we have a big tube that comes in handy on hot days because it blows cold air. It gets very hot, say, like in August, and uh, when you have, say, 30 or 40 people in a room with lights, and uh, people start sweating and using up all the oxygen, and so you need this. Although, you know, I think everyone has probably passed out at one point or another, haven't they? Oh, yeah, yeah. I've passed out at least once a day. Once, we, no, we no longer worry about it. We, we'll be fine. I'll be, yeah. We just keep the camera rolling until you stand back up. Yeah. Put a full mag on. Yeah. Make sure there's zero. plenty of film in there. I'm yeah. good. Oh, you just passed out just Yeah. Time? I didn't realize that. You could escape out those, too, if the windows and doors were all closed. Try it. It's things a little bit. This is Tim. Tim the bunny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you ever use Tim the bunny as stuffing for another animal? No. Tim, Tim's family. Tim's family. So you have, uh, what do you have? You have squirrels and uh, raccoons and what's, what else do you have? Well, there was a dog involved. Have we had other animals? There was a rabbit. There was a squirrel. Are, are these because we have smaller people this year? Yeah, um, that and what I think has gone on as part of the ecological greening of scrubs. Yeah. There was so often half-filled bottles laying around yeah. that they decided, well, we'll just go. That's my own theory. So that now we have, like, for instance, here is a, a smaller half-filled bottle. Right. No. And this would mean... The problem still exists, but in sort of a... Smaller. No. So it's sort of half-green, sort of chartreuse. Yeah. That's actually kind of a smoking gun right there that mm. we haven't... Well, you know, I think we're working on getting even smaller bottles just to make the problem less. So problem. you get littler and littler and littler yeah. bottles. Yeah. What do you have here? Uh, my Bible. Yes. I, uh, I ho hopefully it doesn't uh, you know show up during the show, but I have a terrible lisp, and um, thanks to this, uh, Mr. Steele's work, I've, um, I'm virtually cured. I had no idea. Yeah. I had no idea. I had a, I had a zeta lisp and part of a spice lisp. Do they have laterals? Um, not in this book. That wasn't a concern of mine. They have nil. That's so even if you don't have any lisp at all, you should still read the book. Uh -huh. You should okay. still read the book so to not have anything. That's right. Lispers. Yeah, I guess it could happen after the fact, right? Absolutely. It's to avoid lisping. Okay. You know. It's not contagious, is it? Not to my knowledge. I'm not going to get much closer to him than I am right now. I'm walk back here with you. This is a camera. Oh, it is. Richard, what do you suppose one of these costs? You mean the whole thing? The whole thing. I don't know. Probably about thirty, forty thousand for the camera. I'm probably looking at about maybe sixty thousand dollars. Wow, that's more than I would have guessed. What if you pawn it? What would you get? Probably about one hundred fifty dollars. One fifty dollars. Yeah, it's kind of hard to move this stuff. It's I got all these so. little things. Yeah. Blue things. And I don't know the first thing about how it works. I know nothing about behind the scenes. No, it's easy. All you have to do is turn it on. the switch on this. Oh yeah. Yeah. Does this, right like here. the boom, boom banaca, does this have a banaca attachment? It does. It's right over right here. Yeah. See? There you go. On virtually yeah, you every go. piece of equipment, uh, we have uh, breath spray. Yeah. Because Sarah has breath like a Reese's monkey. Yeah. But we don't mention names, but she does. Yeah. This is alcohol. It is? It is. It is straight alcohol. Well, who's directing this week? That might have something to do with it. Yep. Now that yeah. I think of that. Now that Zach. I think of it. Yeah. I don't think Zach has done a day so no, has so. That's nice. Whew, boy. Yeah, pack a kick? <laughs> yeah, nice. pack a kick. Wow. That might be like yeah, opium laced whiskey. I think I might need a chaser after that. You think? Yeah. If I can find one. Anyway, they're, they're handy. They're handy to yeah. pass them out, or, or you could even, um, if people don't use it, you could throw it at them. Yeah. yeah. We've sometimes done that when you've. Not at off during a take, just to get you back up. To get me back, I, I find little bruises occasionally, uh -huh. and I think, well, I must have nodded off. But it works. Well, know. narcolepsy, you know, is not to be snoozed at. I, well, Ken, Ken, we're back. And good. Are we ready to go home? I think so. We're almost, we got to finish this a little bit. But okay. Right. You okay? Well, I'll follow you guys. All right. All right. That's fine. I don't think there's anything else right. to look at here. I got a list. You got narcolepsy. Oftentimes, this has got to be one of the easiest jobs in the world. That sometimes, if we're shooting here, there are uh, background artists whose job it is to lay in a bed in pajamas 
and don't move. Yeah. So they basically, it's basically, uh, we'll pay you for going to bed. Well, if yeah. you have restless legs and their own, then it gets to be a problem. So we have to screen them for that. But outside of that, you're right. I didn't realize that. Yeah. Of course, because that would be a problem. It would oh, be yeah. a distraction in the background. It would be like a musical if we get somebody like that. Yeah, scissor kick them through the whole take. You can't have that. Do, uh, does insurance cover them if they get bed sores from lying around too much on set? I never thought of that. But there was the time when we shut down on Friday evening and forgot a person that was asleep there. And it was like, and the next week was off. So the person was actually there asleep for like nine days. Yeah. If they got it rained and the roof leaked, otherwise they would have died of thirst. It's kind of scary. Well, yeah, I bet. And we, to get away without a lawsuit is crazy lucky. Yeah. I, yeah. There's Ken's dressing room. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's and nice. There's the sound department. It's comfy, that sound. Highway. The rest of us get an actual uh, room you know, with a door on it and whatnot, but Ken leads a very Spartan existence, and he said, not for me. I don't. Plus, you don't like to be hemmed in. No, I don't. I, I hate the feeling of being hemmed in. Right. Hemmed in. These pants are driving me crazy with the cuffs. Yeah. God, it's, you know, the belts yeah. are too tight. Like I had a moo moo. Yeah. Just, yeah. When are we going to write that in so you can wear it in front of camera? I know. I tried to just wear the lab coat without all this stuff. You know. You have like a dicky that looks like a suit and tie. Yeah. And actually, down there, you're just free and clear. Yeah. I'll call a wardrobe if you like. Sure. Yeah. All right. Tell them. Yeah. Here's the ladies' room. Oh, I thought that's where they kept all the women. Oh, no, no, I think it's just a bathroom. You thought you could find women in there? Yeah. You know, for all I know, that could be true. I've never they keep the time. door closed all the time. Yeah, uh, Patrick. everybody's this afraid Patrick. to knock. Patrick's yeah. from another country. How do you country. do? Yeah. How do, you do? Planet. It's nice to meet you. We were talking yes. about, the. Uh, none of us know what country you're from. We just know that you talk funny. Yes. Um, yes, is that where you're from? That's right. I do talk funny, yes. Oh. I'm from another country. Like, like... Like to give it a spin? Yeah. Wait, was English, what, did you learn English in this country or before you came here? I learned it well before I came here. You did? Yes. At like uh, school. School? Yes. So you're at school where you were? Yes. That's a big hint. We had school yeah. and back gardens. Back gardens? And fire. And mint juleps? Yes. So you had fire. Mm -hmm. I don't know what a, a, a back garden is. That's some It's a bit like a yard. Thing. But this it's is that. in the back, mm. out back, you know. Yard, yeah, that. back bit. That's mm. like Texas. But, yeah. <laughs> That's, is that where you're from, Texas? Yeah. yeah. Mississippi. Got it. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> Mississippi, Texas. Yeah, they do have Patrick, Mississippi, Texas. Texas. <laughs> Thank you, Patrick. <laughs> Extraordinary work. We keep these things around to keep me on my toes. Just so in, that I, in case anybody know. wants to know, uh, yeah. if, if you start to, you, because may I, may I demonstrate? Would you demonstrate? Like, well, I guess I'll be leaving. Hold on. See? Yeah. I was almost out the door. Not nope. an exit. Despite the fact that you can see the outdoors six feet away, no. This isn't an exit either. Oh. I think if you push the other side. Here's a shot. I'm telling you. See? You should put a sign there. Other end. Yeah, I need to make sure that's clear.